Clare County is also hiring or trying to. The starting salary, six figures. Kit Doe on the tech jobs that no one seems to want. Even though it's in the heart of Silicon Valley, Santa Clara County has a peculiar problem. It has more than 40 open positions in IT. We compete for employees, and so we have to make our case. We haven't done a very good job of making our case. County tax assessor Larry Stone has nine IT positions open in his office alone, trying to launch a brand new property tax system that will become the model for the entire state of California. It's a perfect storm of reasons why there's an IT shortage. The county is undergoing a massive technology upgrade, baby boomers are retiring, and they are competing for talent with some of the biggest and most successful companies in the world. But that's not all. The county is battling an image problem that government is slow, inefficient, and kills innovation. It's a hard stereotype to overcome when people are used to sterile, cold government offices and government technology. We are up to date as any place uh, in Silicon Valley. The county cannot compete with the private sector in free lunches and perks, but the pay is somewhere between $100,000 and $200,000 a year. The county does offer a pension and something you really can't get anywhere else, a promise of a job through the tech booms and busts. We don't have bonuses and and stock options and so forth, but we do have job stability. Finally, they say it's challenging, meaningful, important work that touches the 1.7 million lives of every man, woman, and child in the county. Making a decent living, having a good work environment, and still getting to change the world. In Santa Clara County, Kit Doe, KPIX 5. Now the county is getting help from job search agencies, but the average time it takes to fill a position is still about 200 days.